Hello everybody, welcome back to another new and noteworthy mod review. Today we're going to take a look at the Death Pack. Now this mod can be found on the FarmingSimulator.com website or the in-game downloadable content menu. And as of the 1.0 release, this mod is available for PC only. I honestly do not see this mod coming to console, at least not in this iteration, because this iteration is using custom scripts in order to do its functionality. Now, what is DEF? You may not know what DEF is. I honestly didn't really know what DEF is. I kind of knew what it was, but I didn't really know what it was. So here's a little breakdown from the Googlepedia of Wikipedia. It is diesel exhaust fluid, also known as DEF, is AUS32, also marketed as AdBlue. It's a liquid used to reduce the amount of air pollution created by diesel engines. Specifically, DEF is an aqueous urea solution made with 32% urea and 67.5% deionized water, DEF is consumed in a selective catalytic reduction that lowers the concentration of nitrogen oxides in diesel exhaust, thus making it cleaner air. I have absolutely no idea what any of that means, but you know what? I don't have to in order to enjoy this particular mod. So. Lots of people may not know that DEF was actually in Farm Sim 19. Lots of vehicles had DEF as a fill type, it just wasn't exposed to us as a player. When FS22's fact sheets came out, a lot of us were thinking, oh, we're going to get DEF maybe in a bit more of an interactive gameplay element because they were publishing not only the fuel capacity, but also the DEF capacity of many vehicles. Alas, when FS22 came, it was once again kind of hidden in the background. You don't see it on your fill indicators. When you go to the pumps, you just fill up with diesel fuel. Magically, your def gets refilled also, and you are just going to go off on your merry little way. This mod brings it to the forefront such that you have to pay attention to your def levels in addition to your fuel levels. So let's go ahead and see what makes up this particular mod. We go to mods and DLCs in our shop. We're gonna to go to the Def Pack. And once in the Def Pack, we have several trailers and other options that are part of this mod. We have a modded FST 990 diesel and Def transport trailer. You can see that Def Blue is gonna go on the left side and diesel fuel is gonna go on the right side. As a whole, it's gonna hold 4,500 liters worth of product. We have the choice of Continental tires or Nokian tires. And then we have the choice of decals or no decals. Personally, I think I would run with decals just so I would remember which side takes which type of fill type. We have also the choice of main color and then rim color. And then we can put a license plate on the back. We have a modded MKS-8 diesel and DEF transport trailer. This is going to be used to buy DEF at the pump, transport it to a storage facility that we can place down and have it at the farm. We once again have a choice of main color, of rim color, and license plate on the back. Then we have a larger MKS-32 for 32,000 liter transport of diesel or DEF. Just like the others, we have the choice of main color, choice of rim color, and a license plate on the back. And then we have the choice of a small DEF canister that we can pick up and carry around, put on a pickup truck, put on the back of a Mahindra, and drive it out and maybe refuel a tractor or truck should we need it. We can get it in 25 liter capacity or 56 liter capacity, just like that. And then we can get an IBC tank of DEF 2000 liter capacity, just like this. But that is not it, because if we go into build mode and we come over here to tools, we're going to be able to put down a DEF pump, $5,000 to be able to purchase DEF off of this pump here. Then if we come over to containers, we have a small DEF tank. It's going to hold 5,000 liters of DEF or add blue. And we have a medium tank that's going to hold 10,000 liters and then a large tank that's going to hold 15,000 liters of DEF or add blue. And that is pretty much the mod as far as the things you can buy and the things that you can put down. 
Now there is another element to this mod, and that is within the vehicles themselves. So I've got a few tractors set up here. Some of these do take def and others do not. So if we jump on into our Axion 920, for example, it does indeed take def. As you can see now, down in the HUD where we have our fuel indicator, we have a new indicator bar that is blue and has the def indicator, which is the fuel pump plus the little plus icon. And as we use our tractor, we're gonna see both our fuel gauge go down and our def gauge go down. Now, I'm gonna address one thing. You may notice that the def bar is a lot bigger than my fuel indicator. Well, that is because I run with the UI scaling in the game set to 70%. I would like to see this mod get updated to kind of pay attention to custom UI scaling settings so that players like me that are running at a different UI scaling will also have the def indicator reflect that custom UI scaling. Now, if I jump out of this and we come over here to the Voltra, you'll notice we do not have a def icon. Well, that is because the Vulture doesn't have add blue as a fill type configured in it, and therefore it is not going to take add blue. We're gonna come over here to a smaller Zetor tractor, and the Proxima HS80 does indeed take add blue, as you can see, but the Massey Ferguson here is completely out of add blue. You'll see that I have completely drained add blue out of this and we basically get a refuel vehicle prompt and we cannot start the engine unless we refuel it let's grab our 25 liters of def or add blue we'll put it here beside our tank and we're able to restart the vehicle and now we are filling our add blue tank, as you can see, the indicator is going up. So what happens if your add blue runs dry, your engine cuts off, you're gonna have to refill it. So now it is two things to keep track of, fuel and def as well. Now here I have a truck and this man truck is currently the only vehicle that requires add blue in the game. There we go, now we have refueled our truck with that blue via the pump. Now if we go to the shop and we look at certain things, like for example, the trucks. We go to the man truck and we can see right here, 400 liters of fuel, 60 liters of depth. So that's how we know if a particular vehicle is going to take fuel and depth or just fuel alone. Here we have the Superliner 6x4 from Mac and it is gonna take fuel alone. If we jump to our small tractors, we have the Zetor Major CL is just fuel. The Massey Ferguson is just fuel. The Proxima HS is fuel and def. So that is how you are going to know if a tractor or vehicle is going to take def and or not. Guys, let me know down in the comments below, what do you think of the def pack? Are you definitely gonna be adding it to your gameplay? I know that I will be because I like just a little bit added level of realism. I'm not super into realism, but you know what? A little bit more realism never hurts anybody. And you know what? If I have a chance of running out of fuel or death, then you can pretty much guarantee that I probably will be doing one of those during pretty much each and every live stream. And until next time, happy farming.